Hey guys, Hammer's my name, and Tiburon Stone version 0.5 is out, which means new game. Um, and it saddens me because the other map I had was awesome. Uh, I've been generating a new one and I've not yet chosen my location. I'm going to use this one because I like this nice defendable position where I only have to worry about enemies from this area. Um, but what I wanted, I need to show you to start with is just this. Settle here. I now choose where I place my campfire, so I can actually choose to, if I want to, I can place myself here or here. I can place myself wherever I want. So to start with, I'm going to place my campfire here and click start game. And bam! Whoop you freaking do. That's a game. I'm going to pause it because I have some things I need to like talk about or say just. Um, now I, I, um, the, I had a live stream yesterday and it was actually really really nice but unfortunately for some reason YouTube just decided to not save the video so yeah even though I told it to save it which is super annoying but essentially what happened was that I was doing stuff and things then I got attacked by four skeletons and uh, I wasn't prepared for that I had one bow so I actually had two archers one being chased and one with a bow that uh, shot the skeletons at the, as they chased the archer and then when they changed their attention to the one with the bow I would swap the bow to the other guy and then they would swap roles. I did that a couple of times until they died. Um, and then I started to build some small houses uh, which was uh, pretty nice. Um, but before that I got attacked by five, five goblins and I almost died because I wasn't prepared at all. I lost two guys and the, some of the guys in the chat were like, this is game over. Um, but I survived, unfortunately. Well, new version is out. And this is actually the, the biggest version yet. Uh, the biggest update yet. Um, but I... Um, the, the, the issue... A lot, there were some issues with... With a lot of issues with YouTube currently. Like, I couldn't reply to comments on my latest video. Uh, on, it was something to do with... For some reason... I could the, the like the the YouTube layout was suddenly like all messed up, so I had to u go do the control scroll thing, and and like redo it a couple of times, like change the the scaling of things until it kind of just fell into place. I don't know what the hell YouTube is doing, um, and I the 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 live stream. I had a guy in the chat that said he was he was from Germany and he couldn't watch it. He had to go to proxy from Spain in order to watch it and I got messages from others as well saying that they couldn't uh, watch the stream. I have no idea why YouTube does this. It is out of my control. It has nothing to do, nothing I can do. Um, but it, it kind of pisses me off because there's no reason whatsoever why some people should not be able to watch it. There, none whatsoever. Uh, so I'm not sure... I, I probably won't be streaming on YouTube for until like I know it works because if the if the video don't save afterwards and some people can't watch it anyway, that's not much point not much well not much point in it. So I'll be if I'm streaming it'll probably be on Twitch and that's more reliable too. Um and I'll probably just keep to StarCraft, not so much Timber and Stone, even though I want to. Um But yeah, that was annoying. Then, and and that's just like when I upload videos, it wouldn't allow me to save my settings and stuff. So so much crap. I'm almost like almost like maybe I should just quit YouTube for like 14 days or a month until they stop shitting around because nothing works as it should. It's really annoying. Um, but anyway, back to the game. This this update is it's huge. This time I'm going for a flat land, but that's because that because there's roads in it. I actually there's so much things changed. I think you can now make roads and they work as designations. The thing is they they don't work. You see that they can't go up and down blocks, so you have to do it on flat land. So I hope that gets changed because that makes mountain maps so useless if you can't use roads and and and. Robbers has said that roads roads will will be a major thing. Like you have to have roads later on. Uh, right now, it's mainly to help with pathfinding. 
and yeah, and he did a bunch of go away roads there. I can now this I'm happy. You no, know, previously I had to like select every single level. I can now do this over just, and I don't need to care about what le sea level I'm on. That is awesome. Um, so I'm actually just going to be like, oh, there's still that cap on it. That's annoying. Come on, just going to designate some trees to get killed horribly and I need to take a look at my it's not a lot of trees in this map okay this this should be fine um, siege craft coming soon I, I don't think I've seen siege craft any before anyway this has been redone you can see here they are now taps this seems to work this looks a lot better to be honest um, and bunch of optimizations this has been stretched out and it now saves like if I do this and load the game later it will stick which is, is nice something I asked asked for as well um, there's also a bunch of new enemy behaviors so before every enemy would just walk directly to your units and kill them now they will roam the map and do their own thing so spiders will dig a hole and kind of nest in the ground and just hide there and then when a unit walks closer they will attack and wolves will run around in packs and like sleep on the ground and, and run around do things kill chickens and stuff and goblins will make camps and, and more will arrive but in time if you don't deal with it so that's kind of cool that's awesome um, and and there's also like he took out the necromancer because he's doing more with that I, I guess and it wasn't yeah he wasn't finished with it um, well, there's a bunch of nice stuff. I, is there more, or should I just get playing? I should just check my levels. Level 3 Forager, Engineer, Carpenter. Okay. What are you? Infantry, Glenn Dirick. Dirick, Dirick. Infantry Archer, well. Um, minor. I got a lot of military. Holy Jesus. Carpenter, level 4, that's awesome. Fisherman, Forager, Carpenter. What are you? You are a miner. I actually don't... Holy crap, this guy is good. This guy has half of his skills in level 3. I think that's the best you can get, actually, almost. Okay, I need to figure out this guy. He's best as a forager, so he will just be my forager. I don't start with a hunting knife. So, you will just gather food. I'll set this to... Oh, the ret return to campfire is gone as well, by the way. Um... So you now have a job, you go here. That's also, I actually, oh, I actually, there's, oh. Guys, there, options. Statistics, not done yet, but now options are in. Pause the game when enemies are sighted. sighted. Uh, pause the game on new unit migration. Pause game on unit death. I'm not going to turn that on, because no need to. Uh, enable vertical sync. Couldn't switch to requested monitor resolution. Okay guys, so my game just crashed when I turned on that. That wasn't annoying at all. Um, also, <laughs> so don't don't turn on uh, vertical sync. I can tell you, draw distance has been changed. I'm just going to, to, to test this because this should kill my frame rate. But now I can draw out super far without that gray fog. Which is awesome. Okay, it's still it's still there, but it's pretty far out. And my computer can actually handle this. So awesome. I'll just leave it there then. Um, whoa. This guy is good for nothing beside. Oh, not this. Oh, holy crap! This guy is awesome. Uh, this guy is just military. I need to check my farm thing. Should I be a farmer? Pumpkin and wheat. I shouldn't try to do farming. Um, I need to figure out who's a good fisherman. You are. You will be my carpenter. Because you're level 4. But you're also a great forager and fisherman. It's almost a waste having you a carpenter. Oh, you're a fisherman as well. And builder. And mine. Holy... Oh, fuck's sake. I cannot decide what to do. Wood chopper. Level 3. You wood chopper level 2. No reason for you to be a wood chopper. You will be a miner. Um, do I even have... What? Oh, never mind. Um, just, okay, there's music and it's pretty loud. 
But it's okay. I actually... That is actually super loud. Just, that's better. Okay, so you will mine. What I want you to do is I want you to... Should I try to flatten this land? No. I will... I will make him... Mine these. Whoops. Um, like this. That should give him something to do. Oh, I'm horrible at selecting efficiently. Like this. He should be busy for a while. I then need to figure out a wood chopper. This guy was a good wood chopper. This guy was a good carpenter. This guy was a good... I'll, I'll make you a fisherman. Or maybe I can rely on... On my forager alone. No, I'll make you a... You were so good at everything. Holy Jesus. Um, I'll make you a fisherman. But I don't have a rod for you. So, no, I won't. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, this episode will... Actually, it will be longer than usual because there's just so much and I need to get started. So, not a fisherman, not a forager. You can be minor wood chopper. Who else would be, have been a wood chopper? You would be. But you can be a farmer instead and turn. Uh, okay, I'll make you a wood chopper for the time being. Um, and Oster. What was your name? Edgar. Glenn Dirick. James. Um, you were my carpenter. That's fine. I need a carpenter. You were just the dude with military thing. I'll actually have you be a farmer just for the hell of it. And, and have you farm things until I need you as a military guy and just don't care about your level. Just lose the XP whenever he dies, I guess. Or whenever, whenever anything happens, just place a farm here. Just do it like this. Did I automatically? Good. Um, and you were my carpenter. Oh, whoops. And what do I need? I need what? I actually don't have a stonemason. That's kind of bad. You can be builder, farmer, fisherman, woodchopper. You will just stand there, I guess. Didn't I actually have a proper stonemason? You could be a stonemason and you could be a woodchopper. That makes a lot more sense, actually. I actually don't know if I need him to be. That's much, be much better. Um, good. Now, what to do? Um, I need tools first. Okay, I need to get used to navigating. Oh, yeah, now you can see all the new things. Add to queue, add 5 to queue, add 20 to queue. Um, amount crafted, required resources, much better. Um, so I'll add a hunting knife, I'll add a couple of hunting knives, and it just says X2, X2 which is nice. I will craft stone hammer, uh, stone axe, stone pickaxe, and I only actually only have one of each, so I have to be careful. Um, and now I'll just add five, now I have one of each, I'll just have, add five more of each, so that I have plenty. What? You failed? Failed due to lack of materials when crafting. What? What am I lacking? Raw. Okay, there you go. I was just about to get worried. New song. Or snippets. Track resource. 
oh yeah this is awesome now i can see i can click this and i can see track resource and it shows up there that is so nice uh, we have people have been asking for that so much and then i can i can go like weapon and i can go oh, i don't need to keep track of my arrows i need to keep track of my ladders or whatever so i can i can be all like Oh, I need to keep track of that, and that, and stone pickaxe, and, uh, stone hoe, and what more do I want to keep track of? I can keep track of my wood, and my raw stone. Isn't, isn't that nice? That is so awesome. Um, really, really nice. We used to equip a pickaxe, but there are none available. There will be in a second, don't worry. Pickaxe. Good. Um, awesome. Still kind of... Nah, never mind. Um, design build... I actually don't know if there's any changes to this. Like, how this works. But that's the roads thing. I don't actually know if it's crafted road or whatever it is. Or if it's just like, I know it, it's a designation like farming, but I don't know if, if a builder will actually go and like place a road texture or something afterwards. That would be nice if it did. This map is actually kind of huge. I need to uh, find my forager so I can give him the knife. There we go. You can now kill more things. And... What I need to get going, I need more wood before I do anything. I should actually have this guy be a wood chopper until uh, the dam swapping around. Because there's no need for him to just stand there. Um, he's making more stuff. That is awesome. Do I have armor? I have, I have some armor. And I have some weapons. Iron broadsword, two bows. Oh, thank god, two bows. I hate when I only have one bow. I actually need to make a fishing rod. I also need a rope. Oh yeah, the, the loot system. Uh, bodies will, uh, corpses will no longer disappear by themselves. You now have to right click them and say remove, kind of like the trees. Um, and a forager will then go and loot them and remove the body. So spiders now carry a drop spider silk that you can use for rope. Wolves drop uh, leather and animal hair and fat. Uh, leather is not useful yet, but it will be later. Uh, goblins can, goblin archers will drop arrows. So that's awesome. That's really awesome. Um, so it, it kind of like implies that more stuff will be like more effects with like with corpses lying around. I think. I think. Um, so that's good. I have a, a pretty good amount of ingots, so that's nice. And yeah, I think that was all I needed to make sure that I had. Uh, yeah, good. I yeah. Okay, so is there any more? My idea is that I want to make a small, um, small town here. Then we maybe I'll add a tower here, just like a small one for a lookout out to the water and the river, and and then some small houses here, and then I will add uh, like scout towers or something. I I actually don't know. Maybe I will build a wall here. I'll I'll, I'll figure it out. I don't know yet, but it's going to be nice. I feel like I there was something I needed to to say that I forgot, but that's a common thing that I feel like that. This guy is just very very angry at the bonfire. Oh yeah, you can craft. Uh, this this is still removable. This is uh, actually has no effect. But then when you go to lighting, you can now craft a bonfire. It takes free woodlock so it's much cheaper than the lamppost so i could actually just spread out campfires all over the place if i wanted to um but yeah also i it's this if 
these these things actually if, if you're like one of the guys like oh i don't i think it's too expensive to be a tester these things have actually been available for a while because robert uh, is releasing like almost daily builds where he just adds new features it's it's not official uh, builds because they are, of course are a lot more buggy and things but it's just to throw in the and have people test them um so that's the like one of the major things you get for being a tester. That's those early tester builds. Um, I have I haven't been playing them because I don't have time to both play the old version for let's play and then also play the tester builds for testing. Um, that's a bit annoying, but yeah. So I choose to make videos over testing. I know I'm selfish. Um, <laughs> But yeah, I, when you, you re, re, new tester builds come out and you read the new features add in and, and you're just like, oh, I wish I could play that in my let's play. Ah, because it's just nice. Um, yeah. Anyway, guys, if you're like, if, if you don't, uh, aren't used to Twitch, by the way, when I'm streaming, you can always follow me on Facebook and Twitter. I always throw out links whenever I'm, I'm streaming anything so and also just for updates it's very very useful i wish all my all my subscribers were following me on those sites because then i it would be so much easier to just tell you guys stuff when something wasn't working or when i couldn't make a video or something so you knew i feel like i need to let you know um even though most of you don't care i guess but yeah and I'll, I'll have links in the description to Twitch, so you can go follow the channel there, the Twitch channel, uh, right away if you just, hey, I want to know every time it streams. Um, the annoy annoying thing with Twitch is that you need to have an account in order to chat with me. That's annoying and sad. But I guess that's the same for YouTube, but everyone has a YouTube account anyway. But anyway, this is, this is the end of the episode, that's why I'm rambling. Um, also, just a side note, if you ever think that I'm talking about something boring and stuff, do skip ahead. No one will blame you. It's not, it's a video for a reason. Had it been a live stream, I might understand it, but this is just a video, you can skip. Um, anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed, I hope you will comment and subscribe if you liked, or just let me know if there was anything that you did not like. And. I will see you guys next time, have fun and have a great weekend, bye.